Okay, we're gonna ultrasound the shoulder for dislocation. This can be used both to assess for reduction after reduction attempts or to just diagnose the shoulder dislocation. You're gonna place the probe on the lateral part of the arm with the probe marker pointing posterior and slowly slide up the arm. Once you find the humeral head, you're gonna slide the probe more posterior. You're gonna be looking for the articulation where the humeral head comes into the glenoid. Once you find both the glenoid and the humeral head on the screen at the same time as you can see here, you're gonna be able to assess for dislocation. You see here that the humeral head is slightly posterior to the glenoid, and this is normal. You could assess the other unaffected shoulder to see what is the normal distance for this patient. If the humerus is anterior to the glenoid, this is pathologic and this is an anterior dislocation, which is more common. The more uncommon situation of a posterior dislocation, we just have the humerus much more posterior to the glenoid than the